Okay, hi, how are you going? Hope you're having a fantastic day. It's the weekend, finally, Friday. I hope you have some relaxing time on the weekend. Take a break from work. Okay, got this one here. I was just reading and it, this was a link and then it sort of wasn't there. It had been removed at that 404 era. And so the Wayback Machine found it, so... I was going to read it. I was actually reading another book, and I'm not sure if anyone is interested in it, but it's a pretty interesting book. So far, I've recorded several hours worth of uh, reading, actually, for it. So this was the book I was actually re reading. It was written in... Um, 1798, published in Philadelphia. So I've, I've recorded several hours of it, and it's actually been proven to have a lot of events happen that became fact, that they were true. So if you're interested in this, um, and this is what makes me laugh when people say, this word was invented in 1964. <laughs> I laugh when I hear that because this book was printed then. And it was called that back then. I think the word was revived in the 60s. I think what the word you're looking for is, is it was revived. So if you're interested in that, let me know in um, comments or check out the community tabs or check out my Twitter. I posted it on Twitter. I have actually had a, a automatic read it. Uh, I don't know if you like those robotic voices or not, but sometimes I'll download a book and just have it play while I'm unable to sleep. And yeah. Anyway, back to the other one. So, the Michelangelo mystery everyone knows, the famous... Uh, Michelangelo painting in the S Secrets and the creation of Adam in the Sistine Chapel at the Vatican. But most people, except for initial few, are unaware of a certain secrets contained within the artwork. Take careful notice of the way God and Adam's hands are positioned in the middle and ring fingers are held together while a pointer and pinky fingers are separated. This makes it him. And as you see, it represents the oldest, most wide spread secret in existence, operating in almost every country in the world with five plus million members for centuries. The Vatican and world royalty have conspired using the vehicle of to play place initiates to into key positions of polit uh, power, positions of politics, businesses, business, banking, media, and an effort, effort to control populations. If this is new to you or sounds unbelievable, please take the time to read some other books. Uh, I'm not going to go and promote that, but I'm here to read the information. It's some really interesting information, and I know most of it, but I'm just not sure if you lot know. Okay, so it's normally this for men and this for the women. Uh, membership of hundreds of famous actors, musicians, models, royalty pe popes, politicians, we begin in Michelangelo's mystery at the Vatican Sistine Chapel. The central figure of Jesus from Michelangelo's Last Judgment, and in some of those videos before I've shared, shows you what is in those paintings. Raphael Sistine Madonna, uh, notice the finger positions, Raphael's vision of Ezekiel at the Vatican, Lorenzo de Medi, ruler of Florentine Republic, Isabella, queen of Castel. Um, sorry, yeah, I should have read these dates out. 1452, 1516. Uh, Fenderland II, King of Castel. Christopher Columbus, 1451 to 1506. Consort, murderer, and rapist officially had discovered the Americas. Uh, Francis, 1494 to 1547. King of France adopted Catherine de Medici. Catherine de Medici. Uh, 1519 to 89, Queen of France, Cosmo II, the Messini, 
1519-1574, Duke of Florence, Grand Duke of Tuscany, Queen Mary of Scots, 1542-1587, supposedly executed after thrice attempting to assassinate Elizabeth I and steal England's throne. Elizabeth I, 1533-1603, Queen of England, makes the same M hand sign as Mary, Queen of Scots, whom history claims was beheaded after three times attempting to murder Queen Elizabeth. Uh, is it a, or an internal struggle? Pay attention to their fingers. Do you see a pattern developing? James I, 1566 to 1625, King of Ireland, England. Now, why does everyone, when they say Ireland, go Ireland? Why is it not just Ireland? Ireland. It's, why is it Ireland? Why do people do that? I mean, a lot of people just do it. They automatically, but it's Ireland. Ireland. And when you think about it, you try not to do it, it happens. It's a funny word. In Scotland, King James' mother was Queen uh, Mary, Queen of Scots. So his mother was tied and executed for trying to steal England's throne. Yet before her death, Elizabeth I consented to King James' accession to the English throne. Well, King James is famous for his version of the Bible. Now, King James is most likely, um, this is the man they reckon um, wrote the Bible and Shakespeare poems as well. Like um, William Shakespeare is, will I am to shake the spear, to shake up, you know, the languages, they got rid of Pictish and all the, sorry for Sarah, but all the languages and rolled them into one, basically. In the end, it's one. So here's some images of him. Nicholas Copernicus, 1473-1543, Catholic cleric, governor, military commander, diplomat, economist, physician, mathematician, and mostly famously astronomer who first postulated a nowadays uncontested theory that the Earth revolves around the Sun. This began the scientific revolution, moving away from the long-held belief that the celestial spheres move around in a stationary Earth. Martin Luther, 18, uh, 14. 83-1546, monk, theologian, professor, church reformer, who led to the Protestant Reformation against the papacy. Galileo Giuliani, 1564-1642, physicist, astronomer, philosopher, supported the Copernicanism, scientific revolution. He originally named the four moons of Jupiter, the Medicadian stars, after his patron Cosmio to the Messini, who was shown earlier making the M gesture. Tycho Branch, 1546-1601, was a Danish nobleman and astronomer, worked closely with Kelper, uh, deriving new laws of planetary motion based on their observations made at the state-of-the-art observa observatory funded by King Frederick II. Notice his stubbly fingers on his right hand, and he makes the M sign. His left hand is tucked under his clothing. This is known as the hidden hand and his other Masonic gesture. So then there's Jonas Kelper, astronomer, astrologer, mathematician who wrote laws of planetary motion, which provided the foundation of Newton's theory of universal gra gravitation. Isaac Newton, 1643-1727, physicist, mathematician, astronomer, philosopher, alchemist, a theologian who demonstrated consistency between Kepler's laws of planetary motion and his theory of gravitation, which removed the last doubts regarding heliocentrism. Prince Rupert, Duke of Bavaria, grandson, King of James, nephew of King Charles. Caspar Fagel, Dutch statesman, George III, King of Great Britain and Ireland, until combining them to become King of the entire United Kingdom. During the American Revolution, against the opinions of his own ministers, King George III tried to keep Britain at war as long as possible, determined never to acknowledge the independence of the Americas, 
and to push their commentary by end of a prolonged war. Prolonged of war promised to be eternal. Adolf Hitler, 1889-1945, President of Germany, responsible for millions of Holocaust deaths. Hitler never met involvement in masonry, but he was the third secret society used in the Iron Cross symbol of the Vatican and the British royalty, and he would see him chosen twice with it. And he's also a Rothschild as well. Uh, Franklin D. Roosevelt, the 32nd President of America, 33, he stayed in office for three terms, 12 years. In 1933, FDR added the M Great Seal Egypt Eagle Pyramid uh, to the back of the dollar. The translation from the bill reads Novus Auto Seclorium. Sorry for saying this wrong. Oh. This is the same Hitler spoke of in 1933 and said National Socialism. We will use its own revolution for the establishing of the... It was also the same George Bush referred to in his 9-11-91 State of the Union Address. What is at stake is more than one small country. It's a big idea, a new... Where diverse nations are drawn together in a common cause to achieve universal aspirations of mankind, peace, security, freedom, and a rule of law. Out of these troubled times, our fifth objective can emerge now... We can see a new world coming into being, a world which there is a very real prospect of. Just three days after the other, and uh, <laughs> CCR member Gary Hart's in the C-SPAN, there is a chance for the President of the United States to use a dis disaster to carry out a phase his father used, and that is, if you are unaware of the Vatican, the Royal Secret Society, and the agenda, please take the time. Doris Day, 1924, actress and singer, Tina Turner, 39, singer and actress known as the Queen of Rock and Roll, Elvis Presley, 35 to 77, actor known as the King of Rock and Roll, Frank Sinatra, 1915 to 1998, singer, actor, he was seen flashing the M sign while posing with a picture with President uh, JFK, even though Elvis was a fellow M, Sinatra publicly said, of Elvis's music, his kind of music is deplorable, a rancid smell, smelling aphrodisiac. It fosters almost totally negative and destructive reactions in young people. Sinatra's statements created quite the controversy, polarized and divided their respective young and old audiences, and ground plenty of attention for both of them. And all publicity is good publicity. Elvis responded to Sinatra's comments, saying, "I admire the man." He has a right to say what he wants to say. He has, he is a great success and a fine actor, but I think he shouldn't have said it. This is rock and roll, and it's a trend, just the same as he faced when he started years ago. Now I remember my mum speaking about that. Yeah, uh, Sammy Davis Jr., twenty-five to ninety, um, all-around entertainer, singer, dancer, comedian. Sammy Davis Jr. was a admitted confirmed. As Satanist, he was a member of Sinatra's and famous Rat Pack. In the picture of the left, Sammy makes the M Madura, and in the picture on the right, he is hanging out of the Oval Office with Richard, Nick Richard Nixon. Sir Paul McCartney, 1942, knighted by the Queen and Ringo Starr, out of the Beatles. Bill Cosby, 1937, comedian, actor, accused of by 13 women, of sexual assault, molestation, awarded the 2002 Presidential Medal of Freedom. Bing Cosby, 1903-77, singer and actor who physically and psychologically and sexually abused his children, two of them have committed suicide. I didn't know that. Poor children. Jerry Lewis, 26, comedian, actor, producer and director known as the King of Comedy. She could Walsh, 1940, actress, married towards four times. Cher, 1946, singer, actress, married twice, twice, her relationships with Tom Cruise, Les Dudak, Eric Stolz, and many other young Hollywood stars. In 2008, she's currently dating three younger men simultaneously. So, Mick Jagger, 1943, Keith Richards, 43, Rolling Stones, both Mick and Keith, have been convicted of in court multiple times and spent time in jail. Keith has three children out of wedlock and is, was a hard drug addict. 
In October 1978, he pleaded guilty to possession of heroin and received a meager punishment of mandatory rehab, one year probation and two benefit concerts. When Sir Mick Jagger was knighted by Prince Charles, bandmate Charles Watts said, in according to the Rolling Stones, anyone else would be lynched. Eighteen wives and twenty kids, and he's knighted. Fantastic. Unreal. David Hasselhoff, 1952, actor, singer, Marion Dwarfs, twice arrested, thrown out of Wimbledon, put into AA in rehab for alcoholism, and currently has a hundred year restraining order from ex wife for violent behaviour. Freddie Mercury, 46 to 91, from the band of Queen, had many lovers, frequented grave bathhouses, died of HIV, AIDS. I thought he died in the, um, Late seventies, early eighties, Freddie Mercury. I didn't didn't realize it was there. Pamela Anderson, nineteen sixty seven, actress, model, producer, author, married dwarfs three times to Tommy Lee, Kid Rock, and Rick Solomon. Natalie Portman, nineteen eighty one. Um, Natalie Portman um, married Charlie Sheen. Uh, look at the woman's hair, not Natalie Portman's dress. Oh, yeah. Cameron Diaz, 1972, model, actress, germaphobe with OCD, supported Al Gore, dated a Rothschild. Al Gore, U.S. Vice President, 1948, Senator, Democratic Representative, Royal Bloodline, descended from Edward I, Roman Emperor Louis II, Charles II, and Charlemagne, which makes him cousin with Richard Nixon, George Bush, among others. He is currently working with the UN trying to convince the world that human CO2 emissions are responsible for coming environmental catastrophes. The UN solution to the world's fight. First global tax on carbon to save the earth. George Clooney, 1961, actor, director, producer, writer, son of Nick Clooney, US Democratic representative from Kentucky, TV journalist and anchorman. A gang show host married dwarfs, and he says you never marry or have kids again. George Bush, George W. Bush, 1946, U.S. President, Governor, or owner of oil company, co-owner of Texas Rangers baseball team. Bush himself directly related to 16 former U.S. presidents, including George Washington, Mildred Fillmore, Franklin Pierce, Abraham Lincoln, Ulysses Grant, Rutherford B. Hayes, James Garfield, Grover Cleveland, Teddy Roosevelt, William H. Taft, Calvin Coolidge, Herbert Hoover, Franklin Roosevelt, Richard Nixon, Gerald Ford. He is closely related to the King of Albania and has king kinship with every member of the Royal British family and the House of Windsor, which are Rothschilds. He is related to 20 British dukes and the 13 cousins of Britain's Queen Mother and of her daughter Queen Elizabeth. He is 13 cousin, once removed from Prince Charles, and has direct descendant from King Henry the Third, Charles the Second, Edward the First of England. Through the House of Windsor and King Henry the Third, the Bush and Bill Clinton are genetically related. Through Charlemagne, he was related to Al Gore and John Kerry, his Democratic opposition in 2000 and 2004. How does that you make make you people feel when you hear this? You know, like, people at the time were saying stuff and they were laughed at. Pope Benedict, 1927, our 265th Pope, has a smile that says it all. He is consistently wearing a tailor-made red Prada shoes, and this is undoubtedly where the idea for his Hollywood movie title first originated. The Devil Wears Prada, featuring a red high heel and the M, tried it with the B, as in Vatican, symbolising the singled out. And apparently, this is what they were uh, made of. I'm not going to go and show it, because they'll just remove it. But that's what Satanists do, apparently. I don't know. So, Gerald Ford, 1913, 2006, U.S. President, Vice President, Congress, or Representative. Ronald Reagan, 1911, 2004, U.S. President, Governor, Actor, President of Skin Guild, Actors Guild. GE spokesman Reagan was a blue blood knight of Malta and an honorary 33rd degree. 
Condoleezza Rice, 1954, U.S. Secretary of State, National Security Advisor, and Stanford Political Science Professor. Code Pink is a anti-war protest group with over 250 chapters worldwide. The name is played on the DHS color code rating system on 24th of October 2007. Desiree Alfonso, can't say that, sorry. Painted hands, red flash, the M sign. A front Condoleezza he writes, faced and sheltered, the blood of millions of Iraqis is on your hand, and then was immediately arrested. Is it just a coincidence, or was this a stage demonstration? What good could Miss Fez Zeus O's hope to accomplish here? It looks like an over the top stunt to make a rebellion seem a fractational fractal. Later in the book you'll see many examples of such false rebellion. Michelle Obama, politician, member of the Council Council of Foreign Relations, uh, likely you know, was, yeah, Flash, as we know, Oprah Winfrey, talk show host, Michael Jackson, Jennifer Aniston, Mariah Carey, Kate Moss, Jennifer Love Hewitt, Jessica Simpson, Matt Damon, Ben Affleck, Joe's Young, Jeezy, Johnny Depp, Woody Allen, George Lucas, Tim Burton, Britney Spears, Christina Aguilera, Beyonce. She's supposed to be the um, head one of the women's Eastern Star Group. Kira Knightley, Catherine Heigl, Britney Murphy, Lindsay Lohan, Drew Barrymore, Milena Jovovich, Molly Ringwood, Amy Poehler, Sarah Michelle Gellar, Halle Berry, Paris Hilton, Jennifer Hudson. So, Paris Hilton and, yeah. It promotes itself as a philanthropic club of men of morals and perpetuates this image through its members of the first three blue degrees. 90% of all Masons fall into this category and they are often upstanding citizens, pillars of the community who are truly charitable and benevolent. However, the higher degrees, the inner circle of wealth, use society's influence to advance an agenda of global control. Although the Brotherhood of appears to be relatively new, it is in reality the oldest continuous network on the planet, dating back many thousands of years, beginning when the stones were first dressed. Today has generally a sinister reputation because the people suspect that this power Powerful Brotherhood has been manipulating and exploiting them. However, the average Mason has never been in the know and therefore merely a member of a social club. Nevertheless, the higher apps have indeed have had their hand in creation on this planet at a large scale for a long time. The Masons are there perpetually hidden behind the scenes, leaving clues of their existence as a Brotherhood, some of which are evident just as not seen. The Christ conspiracy, the conspiracy to create a centralized global fascist state is orchestrated in five cents world by secret network collectively known as the or the they manipulate through secret societies groupings like Knights of Malta, Knights Templar and the Jesuits. These other feeds carefully choose and recruits into the and they are installed in positions of power throughout the world, infesting all colors, race, creeds, and countries. It is not that everyone in secret societies is aware of the plot. The overwhelming majority are not. They operate like cancer to inf- infiltrate and covertly control the other organizations. Most never progress higher than the bottom three levels of a degree. So the three blue degrees and they don't realize what their organization is being used for. So it's concealing an inner brotherhood of the elect. It is necessary to establish the existence of these two separate yet independent orders, one visible and the other invisible. The visible society, splendid camaraderie of free and accepted men enjoy to devote themselves to ethical, educational, fraternal, patriotic and humanitarian Humanitarian, the visible society is a secret and august fraternity whose members are dedicated to the service with a mysterious acronym, 
Academ, a s- sacred secret, those bedroom brethren who have essayed to write the history of their craft have not included in their dis- distant questions a formal disclosure of the treatise, the story of that truly secret inner society which is the brother free. With the heart of is to the body human in each generation only a few are accepted into each inner sanctuary of the work the great initiate philosophers of the uh, masters of the secret doctrine which forms the invisible foundation of every great theological and rational institution so many people 33rd lectures of ancient philosophy the invitation only 33 degree is the highest publicly known it is majority of its members took upon their affiliation with a sort of different from joining a lion's club to optimus or the chamber of commerce from their standpoint this is true even the literature makes it clear that only these initiates who pro- progress beyond the 33rd degree status are educated in the group's true goals and secrets this hierarchy is readily admitted by the masonic Authors. This has always been existed as an external elementary pop- popular, which has served for the instruction of the masses who are insufficiently prepared for a deeper teaching, wrote Mason Wil- Wilmhurst. This has been an interior and advanced, more secret knowledge, which has been reserved for the riper minds, and into which prof- proficient and properly prepared candidates who voluntarily sought to participate in it, were initiated to Mars, said Rule of Secretary. So I'm not going to say these words, and don't want to go cursing myself. He's the author of Anton LaVey, 1930-1997. Uh... Gives the sign, beautiful actress like Jane Mansfield, Marilyn Monroe, used as sex tools by the elite, and had men such as singers Sammy Davis Jr., or dozens of rock and roll entertainers, or also toys providing fun and games. Entertainment for the elite, Davis was made an honorary, and Michael D. Aquino, um, blonde bombshell actress Jane Mansfield, was so an armored of satanic worship that she had a pink and black Baphomet idol custom made just for her. She wore an idol around her neck at the San Francisco Festival in 1966. Hollywood involvement in satanic darkness continues today, though their names have changed. Helen Keller, 1880-1968, occultist, author, blind, deaf, mute, nephew of General Robert L. E. L. Lee, friends of with Mason Mark Twain. Mark Twain isn't his real name. No, his name's not Mark, Mark Twain. Okay, so his real name, right, was Sam, Samuel Clemens. Samuel L. Clemens. Or Samuel Longhorn Clemens. That was his real name. And November 30, 1885, Florida, Missouri. Died 21st of April 1910. Uh, awarded the Presidential Medal Freedom by Lyndon B. Johnson. Helen Keller is one of the most who dedicated devil horn signs would mean I love you in the American Sign Language. The sign is confused with the deaf signing of the phrase I love you which at first appears as an odd resemblance we registering our eye get an emotion when we discover that the person who invented and created the hand sign system for the deaf, Helen Keller, was herself an occultist and a theophysist. Did Keller purposely define, design the deaf, I love you, sign to be such a remarkable imitation of the classic sign of Satan? Was Keller saying basically, I love you, devil? So... Even though this has been a satanic sign for centuries, thanks to Helen Keller, it has been twisted and too exotically 
mean I love you sign lang in sign language. Historically, however, you can tell by the looks of the, these. Okay. Some stuff I have to skip because, yeah, I, I don't know. There's no pictures or anything in I don't know about some of the stuff. But most of the stuff is right. Stan Lee, 1922, writer, editor, artist, president, chairman of Marvel Comics. I think he's dead. Uh, creator of Spider-Man and many other superheroes now uh, teaming up with the UN and use Spider-Man to promote its image to children. As a B 4th of January 2008, BBC article read, the UN recently announced a union with the comic book company Marvel. Together they have aimed to print a special comic that will see the superhero fight alongside UN aid workers and peacekeepers. The Marvel scribes have offered to pen the work for free. The UN is, is seeking private black backing so it can distribute 1 million free copies to American school children. Papa Smurf, leader of the Smurf, yeah, he does it. Uh, Ronald James Duo, 19, the singer, 1942, singer for metal bands. Don't worry, Black Service was the first to bring the devil horns to Madra to metal music, thanks to metal bands like Kiss, Metallica, Black Sabbath, others. This Madra is now synonymous with metal and has been popularized as metal horns, heavy metal. Gene Simmons, 1949, singer of metal band Chris and an Ackerman was just been removed to be Knights of Satan's service in this picture. Okay. So, Simmons openly supports his Bush's foreign polish. Simmons, let me skip. Charles Dickens, 1812 to 1870, foremost English novel novelist of the Victorian ever. His name Dickens comes from the adjective what the Dickens is a substitute for devils. So here we are, we have Charles Devils Dickens as giving us a cryptic devil horns of right hand. Dean Martin, 1970-1995. All rounder entertainer, singer, actor, comedian. Martin was a high school drop work with Marfield Ties, play with straight men, comedy duo. Martin Lewis and sang in Sinatra's infamous rat pack. Married, divorced three times, a total of eight children, had a reputation of being an alcoholic, and had even had vanity plates that read drunky. Jerry Lewis, Bing Cosby, Aaron Berry, Secret, Plymouth Island, Elizabeth I, we got William, 1982, she was in 1926, Gerald Ford, 1913 to 2006, we got this guy, we got this guy, I'm not going to say this because it'll just, yeah, I'll pick it up, we got Airy Fish, Felsha, John Edwards, Tom Rice, Silvio Bottarini, Boscredi, Nicholas Sarkozy, U.S. President Ronald Reagan, Dick Cheney, Bill Clinton, George W. Bush and family, Thanksgiving Shawata, Dan Quayle, Kenneth Copeland, Jesse Duplass, Benny Hinn, Rodney Brown, Pat Robson, Maria Shriver, Jim Capato, The Beatles, also known as the British Invasion, Cher, Billy Idol, Donna Ross, Celine Dion, Christina Allegria, Denise Richards, Brittany Murphy, Charlize Theron, Britney Spears, Drew Barrymore, Selma Hayat, Edward Norton, Courtney Love, Jennifer Lopez, Bill Mayer, Dennis Spade, Michael Jackson, Jim Carrey, Jay-Z, Fabulous, John Travolta, Kate Moss, Mariah Carey, NSYNC members, Dustin Timberlake, all the band basically, singer, actor Lance Boss, singer, actor, producer, writer Joey Flattone, singer, actor, Dwayne Johnson, The Rock, actor, wrestler, Johnny Depp, Little Lon, Jim Brewer, Kira Knightley, Snoop Dogg, Amy Grant, Wine, Amy Winehouse, Jennifer Aniston, do you see the, uh, Paris Hilton, Usher, Halle Berry, 
Meryl Streep, Sylvester Stallone, Beyonce Knowles, Sasha Bowen, and Karen. The scriptures say that love and money is the root of all evil, not just some evil, but all evil. The concentration of wealth into the fewer hands translates into the concentration of evil into the fewer and fewer hands. The idle wealthy soon lose perspectives and are out of touch with the serfs and vessels. The slave state at its zenith is run by its dullards and silly men who have themselves convinced that a secret handshake made in front of a camera or a hand flashed, something flashed by them on a TV news program, or turbo props their personal progress in the ranks of the elite, they are also convinced that they use their covert singles, grips, handshakes and their symbols helps in their acquisition of a greater satanic power, leading to the greater control by them over the unknown pleasantry. Texas Mars Time Inc. was founded by country, was it by countries being managed by members of the Council of Foreign Relations and a cult Skull and Bone Society, Time Inc. owns newspapers, magazines, book houses, movie houses, book publishers, and over 30 TV stations. Madonna, Michael Moore, Donald Trump, Val Halvel, House Morley, House Minority Leader Richard Gerfart, Gordon Brown, was it Gin Wine, Jay Z, Diamond Dallas Page, Frederick V, 1723 to 1776. Some of them. John Lennon, John Paul, Richard Nixon, George Bush, Hillary Clinton, Tim Curry, Queen Latifah, Prince, Will Smith, Fergie, Kremlin, Lucy Liu, Jessica Simpson, Lindsay, Lindsay Lowen. The V is for Vulcan, everyone knows one Spock's famous V hand sign. But does one know that it's the devil and Tarot also makes that sign? Gene Roddenberry, the creator of Star Trek, was a 33rd degree Scottish right. That's why we have Scotty Spock's hand gesture, the pyramid shaped communicators and other symbols. The name Captain Kirk comes from circle, which means church in Scottish. So the name Captain Kirk is the head of the Starship Enterprise. What an enterprise? Whose enterprise do you think? Take note of the Vatican actually finds and controls every astronomical telescope and observatory in the world. All fundings run through the Vatican before both public and the scientific communities. What does this tell us? Meanwhile, the Masonic movies, movie music industries gives us stars, superstars, divas, celebrities, models, idols to worship. Tom Cruise. So Nicole Kidman is also one as well. So, I don't know if you're still with me now, watching. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I don't know if I'll put this up as a thing and join you in the chat and watch it with you. I don't know. Um, but I'd like to say thank you to everyone and thank you to all, all my long-time subscribers for coming back and supporting me and to all the new subscribers. Thank you. Appreciate it. And to all you lurkers out there, hello. <laughs> Alright, see you in the next one. Bye.